stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands. One nation under God. Indivisible. With liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Today on h and News, we'll go over the daily announcements. And counselor and club updates. Today is Wednesday, March 22nd. And you're watching h and News. Good morning, Hawks. I'm Mark Roman. And I'm Dominique Smith, and here are your morning announcements. It's prom week, everybody. <laughs> and for today's spirit dress-up theme is elegant extravaganza. Dress up as someone famous. And to keep track, tomorrow's theme is eternal slumber. Hey, Hawks. The Junior Council is hosting a fundraiser over at Cafe Zupa's at the Centennial Center today from 4 to 9 p.m. Tell them you're with Northwest CTA so we can get 25% off profits. Hope to see you there. Hey, Dom, guess what? What's that, Mark? Street team's back. Really? Mine is Ben, sadly. Oh, oh, hey, hey, it's okay though, as long as you're there. Let's roll it. Hey guys, I'm Mark Roman. And I'm the other guy in the news. And, and together, together, we're Street, street team. team. Hey guys, so we usually film this during lunch, but sadly, Ben no longer has my lunch. Which means it's only me and Fernando today. Let's go, Fernando. All right, what, what are you doing over spring break? Sleep. Just sleep? Nothing else? No. Wow. Uh, you hang out with your girlfriend? I... No. Um, I'm probably most likely gonna play video games and go to gym. Oh, yeah! Uh, I'm gonna go to Disneyland with my family. Oh, Disneyland? Yeah. That's pretty expensive. Is. You bougie like that? Uh, apparently. You going to like the regular Disneyland or like California Adventure? Uh, we're gonna do both. We're gonna start California Adventure and then we're gonna go to Disneyland. You're really bougie. <laughs> How many people do you think you're gonna pinch for St. Patrick's Day? Three. You're never gonna get pinched. <laughs> because that's the color of money. Uh, give me like five. Who do you think? Like what people? You, you got Madison, you got Chris. Do you have allergies this season? No, I don't. Do you know anyone that has allergies this season? I, I do. Hello. Do, do you have allergies? A little. Just, just a little. So what, what if I did this? Are you gonna catch a leprechaun? Yes. How? Follow the rainbow. Yeah. How? You gotta, you gotta get gold. <laughs> like, they're attracted to gold, so you gotta just lure them to it. <laughs> we'll be right back after this break. Excuse me, bruh. You're excused. And I'm not your bruh. But you know who is your bruh? The FFA people at the donut stand. That's right. Every Friday morning, you get a donut for a dollar. Did you just say donuts for a dollar, magical cow? That's right, random person in the hallway, every Friday morning in the cafeteria on the stage. Another day, another dollar. You know, there was a lot of testing going on before spring break. Oh yeah, let's send it to Jackson Parks with some information about CTE testing. Hey Hawks, I'm Jackson Parks with HMG News. Let's talk about CTE testing. Juniors are preparing for and taking the Career Readiness Assessment and Program Test. These tests are essential to obtaining the College and Career Ready Diploma and are required for all students to graduate. So CTE tests are the tests that are associated with all of the programs that students here at Northwest CTA um, take. It typically occurs um, during your completer level course, which for most students will be their junior year and for some programs their senior year. It's an assessment that um, addresses all of the standards and objectives and the skills that you've learned over the course of uh, three to four years um, and you're tested on it to see if you meet the cut scores for each program. The CTE and program tests are one of the things that set apart NWCTA from other schools. These tests allow students to test their career readiness and prepare for them for a workplace environment. A workplace readiness skills assessment measures student proficiency in the employability skills for career readiness state standards. The end of program technical assessments are program specific and measure the skill attainment of students who have completed a program course. My CT experience went really well. I was able to answer all the questions really genuinely. 
Um, it did take a long time, but I feel like I, I really, really learned from it. HMG News, which is all juniors, good luck on their CTE and program tests. I'm Jackson Parks, back to the studio. Wow, thank you, Jackson, for filling us in on the CTE testing. The Cafe Ziegler fundraiser is not the only event happening this week. Tomorrow, Thursday, March 23rd, is movie night taking place on the field. Free entry and snacks will be, will be $1 cash only. Don't forget to bring blankets and pillows. We hope to see you there. Calling all juniors and seniors. If you haven't gotten one already, prom tickets are on sale until this Friday, March 24th. You can purchase your tickets for $50 on the stage uh, in the cafeteria during both lunches. And on that note, thank you for watching this edition of HMG News. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at hawkmediagroup.news. And follow us on Twitch at HMG underscore Twitch. You can also catch up on previous episodes on our YouTube at HMG News. I'm Mark Roman. And I'm Dominique Smith. Ooh, Have a great day. Freedom.